What's up everyone, my name is Rossi from Soft.com and today we're going to review Spybot, uh, well, Spybot Search and Destroy. Now, uh, this product has been there, uh, I, don't know, I, I don't know the history of it, but I know it's been there for quite a while. I, mean, I know, um, ever since I started to use a computer, word, actually, I, I was started... Uh, actually, when I was 13, uh, that's when... First, my parents bought me a computer, which was my family's computer. We all used it. And we sell the old dial-up internet, which was really bad. Now we had to get this product some ways. Uh, okay, here we go. Yeah, we can download from CNN because there, there's some malware in this computer. Uh, it's the virtual machine from Norman review. Uh, I did not remove any malware when mal malware was scanning. So search by what search it has chance to get rid of some junk on this computer. Hopefully, hopefully it will job, but um, this is what I'm going to do. Since this is not a preven this is not a prevention video, it, it, since this is um, not to show you how many malware spy but search the circuit block, because uh, it will not block any malware, trust me, it will not. I'm going to just uh, show you how well can remove malware from people's computer, maybe. Maybe we're gonna do a real bad job. Maybe we'll do a good job, but you know, I did. I did hear people say it's a really awful product. Some people say it's a best good product. Well, right now we're going to find out it's a, it's a how how well it will remove mail from this computer. Now, this is what we're going to do. We're going to do a full scan with. Uh, if you can download this, my this monitor is extremely slow. This is what we're going to do. I'm going to download and install uh, Spybot Search and Destroy. We're going to do a full scan. And then we're going to scan with Malabytes. If Malabytes find some stuff, and basically it's a big fail. Basically, this product is. Um, I'm going to give it a thumbs down. All right, I'll pause. I'll be right back. And one more thing. Yeah, if you, I'm not running a. Um, I'm running a child version of uh, Microsoft uh, Home Edition, I think, because for some reason I can't find my professional version. I looked everywhere in my house. I can't find it. I know I had it somewhere, probably. Or I'll, I'll lend it to someone. And I don't know. Anyways, I can't find my professional version of uh, Windows. Uh, so basically, I, I, all I can find is uh, Home Edition. So I start using. I'm using it right now, and I probably will use it. Um, uh, for actually, I I am planning to upgrade to Vista Seven real soon. I don't know when, but. Maybe in the future, but uh, this, uh, for some reason my internet is extremely slow. Let me, let me close this. Yeah, if you notice it, I have a U turn on my um, host. Yeah, exit. Basically, I'm, uh, I'm trying to. Uh, it's it's for the Ubuntu uh, thing I'm trying to download from my computer. Trojan. Uh, well, that's kind of that's kind of cool icon. I kind of like that. It's, it's look that cool. Okay, spy spyware doctor is basically like a rogue malware, but it's awesome and adware free. I'm going to give this one a test real soon. Whatever. Anyways, let, let's just uh, try to download this product. I mean this uh, spy bot search and destroy. Hold on, hold on a second. Let me let me try to get a drink. Okay. Usually, when I make these reviews, usually uh, for some reason I get really thirsty. I don't know why. Yeah, my internet is extremely slow. Huh. Yeah, six minutes or seven minutes. Seven minutes. Yeah, it's, um, I have no idea why it's so slow. I mean, uh, hold on. Let me let me do a speed test on my other computer. Cause, uh, yeah. Hold on a second. Yeah. What the heck? I'm I'm going to record this. I mean, it it is fast. I mean, on my host. But why is it slow on my virtual machine? I have no idea. No. Yeah, 
Yeah, I know you can see my IP address. I don't care, you can hack me. Oops. Okay, looks like our mystery has been solved. Uh, there's some sort of rootkit on this computer. Because um, I can see some of these uh, EXEs, I mean, uh, pros pro processors. There, uh, there's some, some of them are really suspicious, like this one, C, C Clan, Clan. I have no idea what this one is. This one, I have no idea. Well, th these two, I know. It's from my VL VMware. No idea. And, you know, um, and like right now, my CPU is maxed out. Maybe I can. Hold on, maybe I can. Uh, yeah. What the heck is this one? It is pumping a, a, a lot of my resources. I mean, it can be Internet Explorer because I maybe I think this one is um Norman. Huh. You know what? Uh, let me just okay, end it. Yeah. yeah. Not not responding. Yeah, that's very good. Okay, I'll pause. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. No, um, our mystery has been solved. Basically, I have no idea what the heck that was. It was uh, when I can't when I uh, killed the, the processor, uh, my internet was got back to normal. Which this item was corrupted. Huh. It's weird. Let me turn it one more time. Yeah, this item was corrupted. Huh. Let me try to read re-download it. Oh, okay, I see what the problem is. Uh, originally, a spy bot uh, is uh, 15 megabyte, uh, but this, uh, yeah, that's why I didn't give it a chance to download. Let's try this one more, one more time. Okay, that was uh, really painful. I do it like uh, approximately, I don't know, like five minutes, but looks like we got the, we we got it, hopefully. Basically, after doing uh, some research on uh, LimeWire Plus, plus, plus the word plus the, um, you know, if you went to school, you, you uh, I'm, I'm sure w most of you guys went to school. Anyways, um, uh, this this thing's a fake. So, Because after did some uh, research on the site, and I, I looked up the do domain and you know like uh, who owns the site, and it's uh, they try to hide them. You know they they put domain by proxy, which I kind of really hate. You know when people do that. Okay, looks like we had we finished. We're done. Uh, I, I really do, I still don't like their icon a little. Um, I, I wish they could change it, but they had the same one for, for I don't know. 10 years or whatever they've been around. Actually, I think less than 10 years. So I think like 7 years these guys have been around. And, and you know, um, basically, I kind of don't care how it looks like the most important thing it, it does is it, it will do its job. Okay, uh, let's search for updates. I think it's the, the the latest version we have, but you know, just to be safe, yeah, I'll, I'll search for updates. Yeah, no one's kicking. Yeah. Uh, we live in America, so oh, these are these are the servers. I see. Uh, what the hell did you pick this one? That was weird. Okay, I check for problems. Uh, 
Okay, there's no problem, so that, that's like good to um, search and destroy. No? Oh, and you know, it, it'd be nice if you guys like donated something, but I'm not going to do it because it's just for a review. Actually, I did give these guys like 10 bucks once. Okay, what's going on? Is it scanning? Oh no, it's uh... Okay, that was weird. I'll pause, I'm going to start recording when I start to when I figure this out. Bear with me. Oh, I, I got it, I got it. I, you have to hit this button if you want to like stop for it. Stop from scanning, if you want to start it scanning again, you have to hit the button again, so... Oh man, that was confusing. Yeah, next time I need to like, uh, read before I do something crazy. You know what, I'm, I'm just going to put my headphones down. These, these things will hurt my ears. I'm just going to hit scan and uh, I'll record when it finishes scanning. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I just found. I just found out. Blah. It's. Uh, it looks like it's scanning for malware or whatever. Hey, any of you have any like, new headphones or, or new mic, please let me know because th this one right now that... Uh, actually, this is my backup. It's really killing me. Just me. It's like it makes your ears bleed. Hope they're not bleeding. <laughs> oh boy, that... Takes a while. Right now it's uh what six oh seven, and I started recording it at what four. Really slow. Um, I got scan whatever. But uh, there is a little plus site to Norman. Well, this was scanning and found four infections. Actually, okay, yeah, quarantine four infections. So, um, looks like this review is gonna be a fail because I kind of didn't want Norman to find any infections, but. Maybe I should have removed this pro program first before I start scanning with a uh, spy, uh, um, spy bot search and, search and destroy. So, yeah. Okay, it looks like uh, it finally finished scanning after, I don't know, long time, my friends, long time. And uh, so far I found some infection, so that's good. And yeah, okay, so it looks like you found five problems. Uh, check for problems, fix the selected problems. Yeah, I want to fix, I want to fix the selected problems. Uh, about, uh, you're about to remove, uh, yeah, I want to continue. Now, this is probably, is my longest review ever. And I mean ever. Now, um, I'm not exactly sure if these problems are gone or not. Actually, those are just cookies. Yeah, cookies, like I always say, they're no big deal, you know, because you can just uh, get rid of them just by emptying your um, uh, history or whatever. Okay, um, yeah, but most infections uh, Norman found, and I'm kind of, uh, yeah, I kind of did fail this review because I, kn I knew I should, like, um, remove Norman before I start scanning with um, this product. But there was one viewer that did request it uh, for me to do a review of... Um, Norman. I mean, uh, re uh, skin of Norman. It looks like uh, this person that requested got his wish. Now, uh, as I promised, uh, it looks like um, I found only one infection. Because Norman removed all the other infections. So, uh, I'm not exactly sure if this actually it was a Trojan. Yeah, it was a Trojan. Uh, so, let me do a skin with um, 
Malarbytes and see how many uh, things it, it can find. If it finds nothing, then it uh, looks like a uh, spy, spy bot in search and destroy that it's a uh, job. Well, pretty much no one else did this job, but you know what? Just in case we'll run a scan, I'll be back after the scan's complete. Bear with me. Yeah, uh, let, before I start scanning, let me just make sure this product's up to date. I hate this. Allow. Okay, before, uh, looks like, um, Norman has, is, try, is failing to remove those infections, so that's a big fail, so, big, no, no. See, okay, uh, let me click right here. Um, let's see, well, hold on a second. Okay, so much for multitask, I mean, so much for doing two things at once, anyways. Uh, looks like I found, uh, eight infections, so, so. And you know, um, this program, uh, Norman, it keeps showing up, the, this one, but for some reason it keeps failing to remove it. Really bad. Report, wait, wait a minute, spyware, what is it? Oh, it's password, it's one of those password cracker things. Hmm. You know, maybe I should definitely, like, use my credit card on, and start shopping uh, in this virtual machine. Okay, so, uh, yeah, it keeps failing to remove it. Yeah, it, this, like, uh, a few times already popped out, but it, it, for some reason it, can't, it failed to remove it. So I'll pause and I'll be right back, and I'll just wrap this up for today. Okay, how are we going to wrap this up for today? It looks like, uh, uh well, if Norman would not stick its nose into uh, its business, maybe so uh, spy, spy bus search and destroy will find more stuff. But basically I did a really poor job, you know, because uh, I found only one infection and the other stuff is only, only found is cookies. So, what I would guys would recommend you use uh, spy bus search and destroy? Well, uh, yeah, you could. Because it's free, you don't have to pay for it. But, uh, I would s mostly stick with Malwarebytes, because that, that program will give you a better chance of removing malware. But, you know, um, I'm probably going to start making more videos like this, you know, uh, comparing removing tools to uh, mal malware bytes. Yeah, let me, um, let me move my mouth before this computer falls asleep, because when, if it falls asleep, it acts a little bit crazy. Anyways, um, you know, uh, I kind of hate this uh, little design they have normal design, but, um, uh, I would not, I would definitely would not recommend you guys get nor Norm, because that, that thing is waste of money, it's like, what, 40 bucks, 40 dollars, um, uh, yeah, well, they did offer me a discount, but, hmm, I still would not recommend you guys get them. They did, they did, actually, uh, one of the managers did email me requesting to, uh, uh, he did, requ uh, requested a review, and he also offered me a one year, uh, if, if, if I wanted a one year uh, free trial, but I, I rejected it. Also, I j I'll just do a review of the license key. But uh, if any antiviruses are watching this, like uh, uh, Norton or FCQ or Kaspersky, and they want to uh, offer me a one year or lifetime uh, free trial, I'll be glad to take it. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later on. Bye-bye.